Welcome to Module 4, Lesson 21. Today we're going to be uh, taking fractions and we're going to uh, be using our knowledge of equivalent fractions to uh, change them into decimal numbers. Um, so for this, uh, that, that means basically expressing them as either tenths uh, or hundredths or even uh, thousandths. And um, so with this first problem, I have three-fourths. And I, I can look at this number and I think to myself, well, that four cannot be turned into an eight by multiplying by a whole number. So I need to move up to uh, hundredths. And four times 25 does indeed give me hundredths. Now, to keep the fraction the same, equivalent, I need to multiply the top by the same number. I'm in a sense multiplying by one, 25 over 21. And I'm going to get an equivalent fraction of 75 hundredths, which is a decimal number is 75 hundredths. On the next problem, I have 1 20th. And again, I cannot go to tenths right away. So I'm going to go to hundredths, and that's times 5. Do the same to the numerator. And I get 5 hundredths, or 5 hundredths. On this last problem, uh, I need to go to, uh, I can go to tenths on this one. So I can multiply top and bottom by 2. And I'm going to get 16 tenths or 16 tenths. Uh, the, um, we, we learned to go uh, right from 16 tenths, the fraction, to the decimal. But we could also look at this as 10 tenths plus 6 tenths, uh, which is 1 plus 6 tenths which is going to give me that number right there. And that's it for today's lesson.